Okay, so this is going to be a basic tutorial on how to do a basic blend shape in Maya. At the moment I've just got a simple head model that I've made. It's just very simple. The sculpt geometry tool I did about 20 minutes or something. So basically you get your head and then duplicate it. You can press Ctrl D to do that. So you have the two of them, or however many you want to do. And then, let's get rid of that. With this one, you change what you want to do. Now, you can't change anything, like, you can't add polygons, but you can make simple changes to the mesh. So you can select parts of it. You can be able to move the points around, move the faces around. Just to make this really simple, I'm just going to use the Sculpt Geometry tool and just really quickly smooth out this whole mouth area. just so it goes back to the normal face shape just going to take a little bit longer as I'm recording and I've got a very slow computer running here will do. So there you are, we have the basic head. There you are. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to push in the cheeks a little bit. Just like that. You can set the sculpt geometry tool to mirror the geometry. That will mean it will do exactly the same thing on both sides. You just click on the stroke here and then press reflection and then choose X, Y or Z depending on which one, which size you want to mirror. I'm not going to do that because I prefer having a bit of have the different size, a little bit of variation there. Makes it a little bit more real. Okay, so I'm just going to go in and just do a huge open mouth here. As I said, this is going to be a very simple model. I'll just move the distance up a bit. Yeah, as you can see, it's obviously not going to look very good, but it's just going for simplicity at the moment. So now if I just click off that, you can see you have the two heads there. Now what you have to do is you go window, animation editors, and then blend shape. Now this is your blend shape window. You select the two you want to use, and then go edit, and create a blend shape. Now, what this will do messed up. Okay, now what you want to do is you select so there's your second head that's your first head. Basically with the first head, just go edit and then delete by type and just delete the history. This will make sure nothing bad will happen. I'll show you in a minute what will happen if you don't delete the history. And then basically you just click on that one, then click the original. Just shift click it. Go edit and create blend shape. But what should happen is if you watch the original here, just get that out. And there you are, there you have it. So now you can just delete the first one. You just have your simple blend shape there. You can use this with as many as you want. If you select them all and then select the last one, they'll basically do a row along the top here. If you do them all separately, then you'll have go down your slider here and you'll have each one separately. Personally I'm having it having them all set out in here. Anyway, that was a simple blend shape. Uh, thank you for watching.